Hello everybody, and today, part four, I believe, of Shantae and the Pirate's Curse. So we've been having a lot of fun with this. Uh, we're in Cackle Tower, which is the dungeon for Spiderweb Island. Uh, I am doing this live, so I will probably be responding to chat throughout this video. Um, most of these parts are going to be on YouTube, because uh, I was doing Shantae for YouTube and uh, Fire Emblem Three Houses for um, Twitch. But... Yeah, so we're we're kind of we're kind of cross, crossing platforms here. Uh, you know, something different tonight. All right, let's do this. Without further ado. All right, so yeah, we were here. Um, honestly, it's been a couple days since I played, so I might have to remember controls. Where were we? Let me get over to the. There we go. Okay, so there's one screen down that we don't know about, but most of our progress is up. So I guess this direction. Oh wait, we have the. We have to glide now. Alright, I'm gonna backtrack all the way to the bottom because we got a new power up. Um, let me get all that. Cause, yeah, because we got this gliding power up. So let me come over here. Alright, so let me check the map again. Okay, so we're still one screen above where we were. Can I glide? Uh, okay, so it's just that. Alright. Let me come all the way. Alright, and I need to go to the left and then around. Woo! There we go. Alright. This game is beautifully animated. Like, no joke. Ah, crap. Alright, use our iframes there. Ooh, I was afraid we were gonna get hit there. Alright. Oh, we got this switch. But that probably turns on that machine from the other room. Nice. Very nice. Alright, so now we just make our way back. Woo, that was close. <laughs> that was close. Yeah, this was released on the 3DS in uh, 2014, I believe. So, I kind of gave a brief history of, um, Jante, the series, and, like, all the games and stuff that it's had, uh, in my first video. So be sure to check that out if you want to know more. Oh, there's three switches. That makes sense. Okay, so we definitely had to backtrack there. That wasn't, like, an unnecessary... Wait, have we been over here? Surely we've been over here, right? Yeah, we've been over here. Alright. So now I need to reascend where from where I fell down. I guess in hindsight, I should have done that last, but that, that was bothering me. <laughs> I was like, ah, I left an area unexplored. Oh. I did that all very wrong. <laughs> okay, that's an exit. Yeah, that was dumb. There we go. There we go. Ooh, <laughs> wait, that's that's new tech. So we can do like a flutter or whatever. Like we get a, get a bit of height. That, that's a new new tech. Gotta love it. Theoretically, I could have loaded for my save. So I need to go over here, and I can sh should be able to ascend from over here. Yeah, that looks like it. Alright, so can I go up? Straight up? No. Aww, oh, man. That would have been a great shortcut. Dang it. Definitely not possible. Where did I go? Oh. <laughs> that was kind of a leap of faith. I mean, I couldn't see below me there, so... I wonder if I can glide over. I don't want to risk it. The only thing I lose when I fall into pits is health, but... Whew. Not exactly a hard section. Yeah, it's a really good game. I really enjoyed it. If you're a fan of Metroidvania games, this is definitely one for you. Or, or a fan of the Zelda series. Because this reminds me, in a lot of ways, of uh, Link Between Worlds and Link's Awakening. Uh, but both of those games definitely... Um, or this game definitely reminds me of both of those titles. I'm only hitting him for hearts. This seems not bad, actually. Now that I'm listening to it more. There we go. <laughs> I 
Alright, uh, let's see. Oop, I need to go left and down. That forces me down, and that's where we got... I think we got a key from there. That key allowed us to unlock the door from over... from down below. Okay, so now we're making our way back up. Yeah, okay. Cool. This is like, I guess this was kind of on my list of like, Metrovania titles that I need to play. Like, I still haven't played a real... I haven't played Castlevania or Metroid. Um, like any title from those series yet. Which I really need to. But I'm waiting to like find the right title to play. Like this just seemed like the right Shantae title to play. Because like it was generally regarded as one of the better ones and it was kind of recent and stuff. I think the good Castlevanias aren't on Switch yet, so... That goes... Okay. Now I can go down, up, forces me that way. Okay, shoot that. And now, how did that change? Oh, does anyone know how to get this heart? You definitely can't get it from doing that. Let me know if y'all know how to get that heart. That'd be interesting. Oh, there's a switch over there too. Crap, I need to hit that. Wait, we can get it! No, we can't. <laughs> Alright, hang on. Yeah, you can't, like, drop the inner from the bottom. Interesting. Let me kind of casually fall down here. Oh, I need a, I need a key. I need a key. From the bottom. Uh, I might... Get the heart blast into it. Okay. Um, well, I can't really get back to it. I shouldn't have progressed so far before you told me how to get it. <laughs> uh, I can't really do that, so I guess I'll come back and get that later. It's kind of a shame. I don't like leaving stuff behind, but... Alright, now, let me look at the map again. So we're making progress. Let me go to the top of this. Cause... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Okay, I think I want to go... Interesting. So this gets me over here. Now what does... I'm gonna go back over here and test something. What if I shoot down? No, it just launches me here. Okay. That's where I figured. Yeah. Oh wait, there's a true ending? Oh crap. I didn't know. Okay. I probably won't be able to get true ending because I'm trying not to like look stuff up. But... crap. Now I might have to look stuff up. <laughs> Alright. Doing pretty well. Yeah. I like how these are um, synced up with each other. I mean, they kind of have to be. These enemies always get me, because it's like... <laughs> There was a section earlier in the game, guys, where, um, it seemed like they were out to, like, I don't know, do some naughty things with me. Like, those tongue enemies up there were a part of it. Like, they, it looked like they were trying to lick me, and there were, like, some enemies that were trying to, like, kiss me earlier. I don't know, it was weird. It was, like, a fan service section. I don't know. It was, it, was, it was funny. It was weird all at the same time. It was actually earlier on this island. Uh, if anyone knows how I get this heart as well, that would also be useful. <laughs> Probably from the bottom again. But... Doesn't mean I know how. Alright. I don't think I can... Yeah, I can't really do anything up there. Can't even hit those. Aww. Boo. There we go. Oh, you crawl into it? Why didn't I try that? I forgot you can crawl. It's not that side. Mmm... Look over here. Uh, it doesn't look like I can... Can I crawl up here? Oh, I can crawl up here. Nice, from the platform. There we go. If there's some things in the wall you don't know how to get, try crawling. Yeah, good idea. Uh, can I crawl out of here now? Yeah. How do I get out of here? <laughs> Chat, I'm stuck. Chat. 
Chad, I'm stuck. I'm legitimately stuck. I can't get out of here. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Okay, there we go. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> you got me stuck, chat. <laughs> um, Alright, I guess we should just go right. I don't know about the hard squid. Maybe we'll come back in, like, a future video. And get it. Alright. We're in here. What's in here? Got a key! Uh, I guess I should use that key to hit the switch. Logical thing would be to go down and hit the switch. For at least from, like, I can't get up there. Like, there's no way I can get up there, right? Yeah, there's, like, pretty sure there's no way I can get up there. Alright, um, so, was it down here? Oh, uh, yeah, I think it was. Alright. Use this to go down, and then we'll come down here. Alright. E. We are now indoor. Alright, and let's hit switch. Cool. Hope I did that in the right order. This seemed like the logical key to use here. Can I... No, there's no, no way to go through the wall there. Alright. Okay, now the question is, how do I make progress from here? Because I didn't say, see a clear way up earlier. I've only hit two switches, I think. Um. Oh, wait, I can fly over. Whee! Oh, here's the third switch. Okay, cool. Third switch? Yeah, thank goodness they don't have any specific order, because, like, I, I would have soft-locked myself a number of times. Um, okay, where do we re-enter from here? I don't know, it's just this. Is there another re-entrance from the left? Because I could try to get that heart squid or whatever. Let's see. I don't think this is a good... Have I been through here? Yes, I have. Wait, oh, uh, uh, this probably leads back to the... No, it doesn't. Alright, let me get, try to go back and uh, figure out that heart squid, because I don't want to leave it. It's weird that there weren't any enemies there, but I guess that was a falling roof uh, section. So, then we'll go over and uh, find the boss. Alright, so you say I have to get into it from below. I don't see a clear way to do that. Hmm. Does not appear I can... Maybe we... Maybe there's a power we get that we we have to find or something like that? There's no way to get through, like, the top of it, right? Hmm. Ruff, do you know how to get this to it? Should I just, like, fall down? No, that doesn't help. Oh, well. Yeah, I don't think I can... <laughs> Gotta bring those stone blocks over and crawl in. Whoa, what stone blocks? Well, I'm glad you're here, but what stone blocks? <laughs> I don't remember stone blocks at all from what I've seen. I might just continue uh, progress. Things that come up in these guys. Uh, oh, I get it. I get it. I get it. Yeah, I get it. Okay. Got it. So, Ruff in my chat was saying that you have to shoot the switch so that it's in the off position, and then once you're up above, you can crawl into it. That makes sense. Let me get up here again. Shoot that, and... Mm, is it that side? I don't think that's it, dude. I don't think that's it, dude. No. Crap, I thought it was a good idea. I thought it was a good idea. Doesn't appear like it works, though. Unless I'm doing it from the wrong side. Am I doing it from the wrong side? Which I very well could be doing it. 
That was a good idea, though. I, li I liked it, because, I mean, that worked for the other one. That worked for the other one. All right, let me get out of here. We're going to go ahead and, uh, yeah, I think it might be a future ability as well. All right, let me... Oh, wait, I probably should go down here, because we activated the machine. I like how she's just, like, T-posing as she falls. The lights are on. It's ready to activate. Uh, how do we activate it? Do we... Oh, hair. Makes sense. Got a tea bag on him. Now, what does this do for us? Oh, wait. Oh, it's an updraft. Whee! That's fun. Whee! Okay, this is so much more convenient. Whee! I like the background right there. Okay, cool. Uh, so we've made it all the way to the top, so progress is over here. Nice! Oh, arena. Cool. I wish we could, like, hair whip up. That would be cool. Bah. Oh no, these things are a pain in the butt. Ah, crap. Taking big damage. Oh no, I'm taking big damage. Those, those big spike balls do three when they hit you. Ah, crap. Okay, potion time, potion time, potion time. I, did, I, I really did just want a damage boost, so that, that wasn't on an... Wait. Okay. <laughs> I was like, wait, we don't have a potion. <laughs> Alright. Let me use that. I did want a damage boost there, so that was intentional. Crap. There we go. There we go. <laughs> yeah. Oh, crap. And then there's more. There's more. Alright. Get over here. Bah! Get out of here. They got waifu enemies. <laughs> Woo, we got them. Fly away to victory. I wish the tiles would like crush them. That would be funny. Uh, so we need to go up here. All right, and up we go. Key, yeah, key. Good old fashioned key. Yeah, this is exactly like a Zelda dungeon, bar the metro, bar the platforming. This is literally just a giant Zelda dungeon that's a platformer. You know what this reminds me of? If you've ever... It's, it's not a very big indie game, but there's this indie game called uh, Chasm. If you've played that, this reminds me a lot of that for the puzzling aspects or whatever. Yeah, if you haven't seen any of my previous parts yet, you're going to see a lot of fan service and like waifus in here. There are a lot of waifus. Whee! Woo! Oh! Whoa! Man, thank goodness her um, horizontal mobility is so good. Like, she, compared to Mega Man, she moves so fast horizontally. Woo! I like this win. This is a good mechanic. I like it. It kind of reminds me of the um, jellyfish from uh, the last uh, farewell. Gonna hit that, and now we're gonna save our game. Should be the final boss for this section, right? How long have we been playing this? Like 20 minutes ish? If anyone happens to know. Uh let me check. Yeah, I think we're good. Alright, let's see what this boss is. Le boss. Yeah, they just take a lot less execution to actually like float. Impress fighter. Hit chat queen battle. <laughs> what is this? Oh no, please 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 don't be anything like the spider from Mega Man X. Because that spider was atrocious. Okay, so we can hit the eye. Why is there no hitbox on like her legs? Like that's kinda dumb, not gonna lie. It's like only her mouth. I guess she's trying to chit chat with us in a very aggressive way. By like literally putting her mouth right on top of it. Oh. The animations are really smooth though. Like a I have been impressed with the animations. Oh! Wow, that's a lot. 
Ah, oh, crap. He distracts you with the little ones. And then she comes in for the real attack. Ooh, it's... Oh, dang. oh, I need to float. I need to float. I need to float. Wow, how, how did I not come up with that sooner? I need to float. This is cool. This is a really cool fight. Whee! Did it right. Alright, I think we've got the pattern down. Let's just see if there's any new attacks. I didn't really think about using the um, the float in battle, or the hat in battle, but I like it. Whee! How much health does this boss have? Ooh. First time I got hit in a little while. Oh, okay. Alright. Alright, she's summoning core now. She has to be getting close to like a desperation phase or something. She's also moving a lot faster. Ah, oh, dang it. I thought I could. There we go. Ah, oh, dang, I need to crouch. Oh, man, she has to be close. She has to. Okay. Alright, potion time. Because those do two damage. Last potion. No, I jumped too early. I jumped too early. I didn't want to float because I knew I jumped too early. I was trying to get back to the ground. Okay. We've got double fire and quad bugs now. So, she has to be... Dang it. She has to be close. We're also not dealing that much damage to her is the problem. Because I really can't damage her when she's up there. Hey! Alright, alright, alright. Desperation phase. Desperation phase. Alright, there's always there's always been another part. This reminded me of the Mega Man X explosion so much. Oh no, that's it. Nice. Very nice. Tinker bats. Again. Hey! Hey, get back here, you. I usually read these things a lot, a lot for my YouTube video. Another map. Hmm. I really can't do a female voice though. <laughs> Not at all. Oh yeah. Handline Island map. Oh boy. That has to be a fan service section. <laughs> That's one less source of evil for the pirate master. I better could tell Risky. All right. Uh, is there anything else we need to do here? Because I mean, we're pretty much done. With the island, if so. So, I can't travel. Alright. I think we covered everything I really care to here for now. So, I can go in here, right? And, yeah. Get a ride through the ghost forest. The ghost forest was that, um, weird section uh, that I was thinking of. Does anyone have any idea how long I've been recording for? Because I forgot to set a timer at the start of this. Oh, crap. Can I go through here? Woo! Ow. Yeah, tan line, that, that just sounds like a waifu island. Honestly. Like I could, oh, ow. Like I would can just glide through everything. <laughs> I think it's been about a half hour. You're back. Not without incident, but I found another island now. And your hat. Dot, dot, dot. I thought you'd be excited. I've been thinking about my men. And the curse that controls them. We sailed together under the, the Pirate Master's command. The Pirate Master was clever. He'd expect me to go after my pistol and hat. That's why he brought them here. To infuse them with his evil. He's been using the weapons to lure me in. He plans to trigger the curse and put me back under his control. 
I can't believe I almost fell for such an obvious ruse. Is that why you won't come with me? Because you're under the same curse as your men? I'm not afraid of him. I didn't say you were. I despise him. I'd like to see him return just so I can crush him myself. I didn't mean to get you all worked up. But hey, at least we're finally talking, right? It's good to get these things off your chest. I'll wait for you on board. You gave Tan my map. Alright, yeah, so it was kind of weird because, like, you can't... Okay, how do we do here? Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Wow, we missed some collectibles. Alright, well, we know one that we missed. I mean, to be fair, there aren't that many collectibles, so it shouldn't be that big of a pain. We got almost everything on Saliva Island, so I guess that's why. That looked bad. Uh, alright, so we gotta come here because we gotta save and get upgrades and potions and stuff. Uh, let's save. Actually, we'll save last. Alright. Gotta. Oh, crap, I should have bought those in bulk. Ow. There we go. Alright, uh, let's see. Do we have any other upgrades we should buy? Power kick. Is power kick any good? Should I save for that? Do I say for a for a power kick? Because these two are trash, honestly. I'd rather get like um, I'd rather get one of these two. Power kick is trash. Okay. I'm not gonna worry about it then. Uh, probably pistol tune up because that would technically double my damage. That would actually help a lot. I think I'm gonna go damage up on that. Can't really get those. We'll save our gems. Yeah, because, like, one of the upgrades was this. <laughs> like, that's trash. Because you're still vulnerable, you just get, like, a backdash. Like, it's... <laughs> Honestly, it... Yeah. Anyway, I don't understand those. I don't think I have enough squids. Recover actually does something. So what does Recover do? Because to me, it sounded like a tech in place. How many do we have? Oh, we only have two. Okay, so we can't do this yet. Yeah, all these waifus, yeah. Hey, we'll, we'll get we'll start Tanline Island, just a little bit. Uh, can we? Okay. I don't think there's anything in here, right? Oh, Shante, look who decided to make a surprise visit. Guys, mom, how are you? On cloud nine. When I heard my sweet little baby wedding baby bed waited, <laughs> I just I lost all concentration reading that line. My sweet little bed waiting baby Bunsies found herself a handsome young man. I just had to come and meet him. Oh, look at this fun hat. Pleasure, ma'am. You've got quite a gal here. You and Joe? <laughs> I caught him removing one of my bird's nests and we got to talking. Over coffee. And, well, I guess we hit it off. <laughs> she about broke my arm being... being causing of that... Bird I don't touch. <laughs> oh lord. Soon there will be sounds of wedding bells and piles of crying grandbabies. <laughs> Mom! Voice. Jump over, kids. Heavy load coming in. Guy's dad. Ouch! There goes the back. Hope I hold out long enough to see these two lovers tie the knot before I croak. <laughs> oh, daddy. This the guy? Sir. What you do for a living, Joe? Yo, mama. I <laughs> <laughs> uh, tears down schools and what converts them into long range cannons. That'll work. My daughter could do a lot worse. <laughs> daddy! Also, she smells like the barn I was raised in. <laughs> Hold up now. Look at you, daughter. I swear you were just in diaper diapers and pigtails yesterday. Lay off the marshmallow spread, girl. You've got a plump of the partridge. <laughs> Honey, don't embarrass our little girl. <laughs> She's just puffing up to attract a male. Ooh, I think it's working. Hoo-hoo. <laughs> bah. Now have a look at this one now. I brought you guys a genuine artifact from a lost world. You can use it to touch 
Uh, touch Bruce up the place. Blech, I couldn't say that. Give us some culture. I could decorate on my own, thanks. What do you think of it, Joe? I gotta get real close and read it. It's got a message wrote on it. it says here, death to them who reads it. <laughs> hmm. I feel a fit not unnatural. Oh no. Daddy, what did you do? Jiminy, who thinks something this old could still pack such a wallop? Chantel, looks like your old Uncle Mimic was right again. He always said, evil curses stay fresh with age. And's the better relic hunter, any day of the week. Can we please not discuss your work right now? You always do this, Daddy. You want me to be single forever. <laughs> there, there, don't flush. Your friend will, here will fix it. I will? How am I gonna fix this? <laughs> dot, dot, dot. <laughs> now what am I supposed to do with this? Uh... A mummy? There's an inscription. It's probably a curse, so I better not read it, considering the luck I've been having lately. Uh, how do I help him? Because <laughs> I don't know. I, I think we're just gonna leave this situation for a little while. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I don't know what to do. <laughs> Alright, let's save the game. We'll save the game and then play for about, uh, 10 minutes or so on, um, Canline Island. Get a good feel for the start of that one. That was a lot of dialogue. That was a lot. Get some good old-fashioned lore. Alright. We're gonna shove off. That man dead in the girl's thing. I mean, he's technically not dead. We saw a petrify spell on um, Saliva Island. Um, but there might be a way to undo it. I just don't know how. So. Alright. Let's see. Uh, Tanline Island. Alright, let's do it. We'll try to get to a save point. I don't know if we'll be able to do it in 10 minutes. So I might have to. Eh, maybe we'll just let the video long run long. We'll see. Maybe there's some parts I can edit out. According to this map, this is Tanline Island. It's hot! Don't let the immense heat distract you. There's a den of evil here. Find it and destroy it without delay. I'll go and have a look-see. You just leave everything to me. And if you feel cursed, lie back and put a damp towel over your head. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure that's going to help the guy that we just turned to stone. Well, we didn't turn him, but someone else did. <laughs> Where does she get the energy to be so disgustingly happy all the time? I wish there was more more voice acting in this. Alright, where's the waifus? This is Tanline Island. Come on. Come on. They gotta be around. Oh, they shoot stuff. Cool. Did that just do four damage? I don't really want to find out. Maybe I did Oh, I don't think I restored my HP. Yeah. Oh, that did two. Okay. So this thing's too long. Wow. Okay, cool. Hot start. Uh, more waifus. <laughs> Judeing Cupid's arrows or something. Although their death cries make them sound like dudes. I'm confused. Oh gosh. I. Uh, <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> oh my. Uh, this is why I don't rate my videos for kids. Whew. Yeah, that's... That's not good. Ow. Oh, so that was a recover? Interesting. There we go. Oh boy. <laughs> Yeah, I... yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's just that's so bad. Wait, the area floats you with enemies, by the way? Okay. Didn't bother... okay. Mummy, there's an inscription. Mm, it's probably a curse, so I better not reading. Read it. Okay. Uh, so that's a death pit. Let me look at the map. 
Oh wait, so could I not go up above? I feel like I could have. Right? It feels like I could have. Oh, uh, she's back. Okay, wait. Can I get over? <laughs> okay. She does three contact damage? Wow. Well, that's something else. Okay, there we go. We got over that time. So yeah, we can definitely get over here. Wow, I just yeeted him. Yeet! <laughs> What's this stuff? Oh no, that's where he got the vase. Oh no. I don't know whether which way is the right way. So I'm just going over top because it seems like the more beaten path. Hey, a save point. Hey, we actually got the one. Nice. Alright, yeah, we definitely got to wrap this video up here. Because I think I'm about at the 40 minute mark. Let me switch this over. Alright, so we made it to the first save of Tanline Island. From what my chat says, this is definitely going to get more fan service -y. So, <laughs> look forward to that for part 5, I guess. Um, <laughs> this is going to be a fun one. Alright, so anyway, thanks so much for watching us. Uh, be sure to check out the other parts as they go up. And also check out like the Fire Emblem run that I'll be doing on Twitch that I'll be uploading to YouTube periodically. Um, and also check out our Discord where you can share memes, art, and uh, be part of the community. It's a great place. We have a ton of fun there. So anyway, thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in a future video. Rock 2000, signing off.